Hello, uh, this is Keith Berry from Emmanuel Church, leading you in prayers for the 29th of December. We begin with the carol for today, O come all ye faithful. O come all ye faithful, joyful and triumphant, O come ye, O come ye to Bethlehem. Come and behold him, born the King of Angels. O come, let us adore him. O come, let us adore him. O come, let us adore him, Christ the Lord. Sing, choirs of angels, sing in exultation. Sing in all ye citizens of heaven above. Glory to God in the highest. O come, let us adore him. O come, let us adore him. O come, let us adore him, Christ the Lord. Come and behold him. Come and see. Take time to look and reflect on all that Jesus is and offers. That's the invitation in today's carol. In the reading from St John's Gospel, there's a promise. As we see, we trust. And as we trust, we receive. The gift God gives is love, now and eternally. The reading is from John chapter 1, beginning at verse 6. There was a man sent from God, whose name was John. He came as a witness to testify to the light, so that all might believe through him. He himself was not the light, but he came to testify to the light. The true light, which enlightens everyone, was coming into the world. He was in the world, and the world came into being through him. Yet the world did not know him. He came to what was his own, and his own people did not accept him. But to all who received him, who believed in his name, he gave power to become children of God, who were born not of blood, or of the will of the flesh, or of the will of man, but of God. One of the great gifts of music for both performers and listeners is its own ability to connect with and draw out our feelings and touch our innermost thoughts. This happens as we allow the music to reach out to us, opening our hearts. It's a wonderful gift, but like any gift, it needs to be received. Music, if we let it, touches us deeply. Sing, choirs of angels, Jesus Christ, like music, is a gift who needs to be received. When we pause and take time, as if listening deeply to a song, we can feel his touch on our lives. One of the wonders of Christmas is that as we sing together, we are reminded of the gift given to us through the birth of the baby Jesus. Through our song, we find our hearts opening to him, and welcoming him. So come, let us adore him. Is there a gift you could receive today? Might pride or fear be preventing you doing so? Your gift to someone else today might be to receive what they offer you. Let's now pray together. God of love, in Jesus we see you as you are, and as we see you, we love you, and find that you know us and love us. Open our hearts and eyes to you today. Amen. And now pause for your own prayers.
And we say now together the Lord's Prayer. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done, on earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread, and forgive us our sins, as we forgive those who sin against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours, now and for ever. Amen. And may the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, and the love of God, and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit, be with us all, evermore. Amen. Wonderful.